it's not all the time that we get to see John Cena on Friday Night SmackDown, but when he does show up and when he returns and when he's on the show where it all started for John Cena, the ruthless aggression, you know it's going to be insightful. You know it's going to be significant. You know it's going to be impactful. You know that John Cena is going to do something that is going to get people talking, that is going to get people to realize that he is in demand and he is on demand to be the WWE World Heavyweight Champion at Night of Champions. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is the dynamic Sean View Entertainment right here on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. Breaking news. WWE has announced that John Cena will be appearing on Friday SmackDown. Now, is this going to escalate the angle between him and Lesnar? Is Lesnar going to show up? What is John Cena going to say? What is he going to do? Who is he going to face? What kind of ruthless aggression is he going to be giving out on SmackDown? We saw what John Cena is made of. We've seen a different side of John Cena, a darker side, a more pronounced mean streak in John Cena that we all knew he had. And John Cena is going to have to dig deeper than he has ever had. But why is John Cena on SmackDown? What is the meaning behind it? you got to know that John Cena is going to have something on his mind. There's going to be some kind of a plan in motion for John Cena to take out somebody. Will hell be unleashed like we've seen Cena do not only last week on Raw, but also this week on Raw. Although the hell wasn't as hellacious as it was last week. But that mean streak, that dominance, and that satisfaction that John Cena gets from hitting in an AA or an STFU or making someone tap or making someone get knocked out or making someone... Say, you can't see me. SmackDown, where it all started for John Cena, going all the way back to 2002 when John Cena took Kurt Angle to his limits. Yes, all those years ago, and John Cena still stands tall the test of time because who and what he is all about. But John Cena is going to have to go to places he's never been in his entire career. And he may have to dig up a John Cena from his past that he never wanted to do. John Cena may have to do things he's not pretty happy of or proud of. But if John Cena is going to succeed, if he's going to get one over Brock Lesnar, John Cena is going to have to go to all-time lows. John Cena is going to have, probably have to stoop to levels that not even he thought he was capable of doing. So ladies and gentlemen, your comments, your opinions, and what do you think about John Cena's return to SmackDown, the blue brand? Subscribe.